Hey everyone, uh, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Halo Wars. Um, I'm picking up right, right where we left off. Uh, I'm just kind of scooting around the map and just picking out what I want to do next. Um, I really want to get stuck into this game because this game is honestly like cooler than I thought it would be. Ooh, okay, that's cool. So that'll allow us to get more stuff going. Deflection plating research. Cool. Love that. All units. Oh, because they're already here, this allows us to get this going. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Where there's smoke, there's fire, Yugi. Cool, so you can actually break the cap. That's kind of cool. And then where are we headed? What do we even need? Yeah, I'm like, I'm running out of things to buy. All units. There we go. Hoop day it is. What's going on here? Ooh, whoa. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go grab this, guys. I said so, okay. A girl in space triggered, says Halo developers. Here's some extra reinforcements. Play nice. Cool. All units. Yeah, this is kind of surreal, I'll be honest. Where's the homies? Do 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 do. All units. Enemy engagement. Jeez, I have so much money. <laughs> Or resources or whatever the hell. All units. So I'm not exactly sure what I would even need. I assume I'm going to get another uh, thing. Another base to build. Um, I have no idea what it would actually entail. Okay. Since uh, I've got so much money that I feel like I can get by on the stuff that I already have. Oh, wait, actually, guys. All units. We're going to go here. Wow. That's actually really neat. Just to see the whole army. Like, I keep saying that, but, like, it keeps being cool. All units. Rolling. 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 Nice. Rolling. What? Fred Durst should not be as popular as he is. Though I do like the streams where he like would show people his anime figures. Okay. All units. Power lines. And then that'll give us the last few uh Warthogs. And I think the I think that's everything in the level. I think so at least. Assuming I know what I'm looking at. Enemy in 
Black box, collectible item. Interesting. Who is that? Little fuel rod, little grunt, little boy? All right. Fellas, please. War dogs rescued. Rolling. Rolling. I do remember, in fact. I really want to know the mechanics of that. It looks like the trucks are attempting to mate with the boxes, and it's creating supplies. Rolling. Which could be how it works. Hell if I know. Well, I'm about to break 10k. That's cool. Let's Rolling. grab these. Wowzers. Okay. Um, so that's the objective. So let's not do that. Attacking. Next, we will go here. Because I definitely need everything in this area. I mean, what if I need it? Enemy engagement. Well, I'm happy for them. Jeez, they're this close to the base? And they didn't do anything about us? No wonder the Covenant lost this stupid war. All units. Let's do that, actually. You go here. I wish you could zoom in a little further. the AI getting hung up on this. <laughs> okay. Are you doing donuts? Here, guys. How about you come over here, too? And it's still got that stupid little warhog like sound. I love that fucking trash. All right. I wonder if Halo Wars 2 is any good. I'm going to play it, although it'll be a while until I get to it. Which is, you know. Yeah, because I have to beat this game. I have to beat the canon trilogy. I have to... Just go home, guys. <laughs> yeah, because I got to beat the main trilogy. I got to beat uh, ODST. Which is, granted, the shortest in the series, but... Uh, hmm. Black box collected. Halo 4 and 5. Just trying to think of what all I have to do. I might go do the, uh... The... Oh, what are those other games? Halo something or other. Yeah, great. Good job. Actually, wait. You guys go here. All units. Medium. In here. 
And we're about to break 16k. We gotta fight our way in here. I hope I get to play as the Covenant in the campaign. That would be dope. Man, you know what this game is crying out for? A mode where it's more like Brutal Legend. Yeah, I said it. I wish there was something that you could do when you hit this point. This is kind of lame. And maybe it's just supposed to be that, it, you know, if I was on a higher difficulty, then more people would be dying. So I would need to replace units quicker. But, like, I feel like a game should always be tuned for every single difficulty, no matter what that is. You know, it's because, like, Dark Souls does not have a difficulty slider. Castlevania does not have a difficulty setting. And, like, every game should give you, every every game mode should give you something. Let's go down here and clear this out, and then we can only, and then we only have to fight a war from one direction. And then we can scoot up through here, take this out. Although I am actually moving myself into a pincer attack, assuming that there are no people this way. Yeah, okay. It looks like that's empty over there, so may as well just keep going. Oh, there's some hunters. Yeah, like, this is this is one reason that I'm actually really digging, like, the idea of playing as the Covenant more in a game like this. Because in this game, it is, everyone I'm looking at here is all green men and trucks. That's about it. Whereas in this game, you get snipers, like you get jackals, grunts, elites. All units. All units. If the Covenant detonate those explosives, our mission here is over. Get to That's the a detonator. big detonator. Why the hell is it so big? I mean, in a gameplay sense, it's so that... Oh, well, we just lost a guy. In a gameplay sense, it's so that uh, we can see it. But, like, what is the purpose of that? <laughs> Are we blowing up the explosives? Because that seems a little counterproductive. Good work. Prepare for new order. All right, I'll prepare. Mission complete. Build for success. All right. Okay, then. Somehow I didn't finish the other thing, but whatever. Sergeant, is this what the aliens were after? No, they were actually after something down the road. They sure paid a price trying to defend it. All quiet now. Very obvious concept art here. Hey, I, 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 held, I held my hand up. Hey, what are you doing? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. D <laughs> Look at this not Spartan armor he's wearing. What a jackass. See, now everyone standing in that beam is now sterile. Which is good. I don't want any forges running around. Heresy. Remove this that dude really got one needle in the back. Are you for real? Oh, boy. Is it Parliament? It looked like it just zoomed. Like, oh boy. This is Forge. We've been ambushed at the relic site. I'm pinned down with Anders. We've taken heavy losses. We need reinforcements now. Sergeant, Alpha Base will <laughs> be able to respond in time. We've got Grizzlies inbound from Spirit of Fire. Hold on down there. Okay, cool. Oh, grizzly tags. 
Forge's pet project. Okay. So I guess I can't access all the billions of dollars that I had there. The billions of space bucks. You know, they actually recorded more than one all units line, which I really do appreciate. Get up there, guys. What are you doing? 45 hunters. Jimmy Christmas. It looks like I'm playing a Mega Bloks game right now. You know? These big, like, plasticky models. Uh, you can see it, right? I'm not crazy. Why can't I select you guys? All units. Yeah, I just... All units. I don't appear to be able to select them. That's kind of weird. All units. I wonder why. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Oh no, a needle, guys. Like, you want to talk about cutscene guns. That was pretty extreme. Like, the nature of the needle is that it has a buildup, and it takes several bullets for anything to actually happen. And they get shot by one and instantly keel over. I don't know if I've ever killed 45 hunters in my life. Like, even with all the times I've replayed all the Halos, I don't know if I've ever killed 45 hunters across every playthrough of every Halo game combined. Hunters are rare. They're just, like, chucking them at me. Guys, remember this? Remember Halo? Remember the Halo movie? Actually, do you guys remember the Halo movie? Um, not the anime movie that I keep talking about. But uh, there were, there, they, were, they kept trying to get a Halo movie made, and it never, never, ever happened. Never. But uh, what did end up happening is that they took all the props and shit recycled from Halo and made it into their own movie. And that's what the movie District 9 is. That's a real fact, allegedly. Uh, I'm hedging my bets there in case I'm wrong. But as far as I know, that's how it works. Actually, get on there. Yeah. But yeah, they just they they couldn't get the Halo movie off the ground quick enough, and so all those props and stuff became. Well. Forge is dead. Good. And also dead. So yeah, all that is just made... All of District 9 is made out of recycled Halo props. Which is neat. I love... I like seeing stuff like that. And I don't even really know if I would have preferred a Halo movie. You know? Like... It's a video game movie. They might have screwed the whole thing up. All right. <laughs> they pulled the controls. We're cut off. Get me to the East Bridges control panel. I think I can get it activated. All units. Watch that six. We're moving out. I can hear my wife screaming like a barbarian in the other room. I hope everything's okay. She says that she's okay, but... 
Just a moment, everyone. Hey, I'm back. She's all right. Uh, she stepped on attack. Excuse me. Uh, my wife is currently in the midst of remodeling. Because, you know, that's quarantine, baby. So uh, she stepped on an attack and cut her foot. It's a small injury. She's fine. I checked on her. I made sure she's okay. Uh, this is recorded while we still have house guests. So uh, she already had help before I even got out of this chair. Which is good. Let's just get everyone here. It's so weird to just see this little, like, space girl just running around. Hmm. Okay, so let's see what we're working with here. Give me a minute, and I'll get this bridge operational. You heard the lady. Let's give her some privacy. I hate Forge. He's so boring. Watch those doors. Looks like company's coming. From the darknesses. I feel like RTSs might be able to benefit from more genres being added in. I mean, I would enjoy it more specifically. I, don't, I, f I feel as though that is, you know, obvious. Like, because sometimes it doesn't work. Like, you can't have, you can't exactly have an RTS and a 4X game combined, you know? They're just too similar, but not similar enough to each other. Just give me exactly 30 seconds, and I can hack this piece of technology older than time. Like, it is kind of weird that she can just hack Forerunner shit, right? Like, is that canon? Should that even be possible? Use the bridge to kill Covenant units. Okay. You know, is it even worth it? Now let's get the hell out of here. I honestly, like, th this is a controversial opinion in many cases. Uh, I honestly really do like Brutal Legend, which, for those who don't know, is an RTS like this, a, you know, slower-paced tactical game that is also an action game. So... You know, you have your big tactical slow RP, uh, RTS gang. RTS means real-time strategy, by the way. But then you also play as uh, Jack Black on a quest to kill a bunch of shit. So, like, as... <laughs> so, as uh, you're playing as Jack Black doing, like, Devil May Cry combos and everyone... So also, are you commanding an entire army by yourself? 
just you so happen to be in the thick of it. And I really think that that's a cool idea. And that's not even the only game like that. Um, the second Guilty Gear game, kind of an oddity in the series, plays exactly the same. And it's just weird that there are two games that are very American rock and metal inspired that are RTS games that feature badass punk protagonists. LZ means landing zone. And are also RTSs. And like, because Brutal Legend and Guilty Gear 2 are the same game, and I believe they both even came out in 2009, which is just kind of wild. Because, like, they weren't ripping off one another. They came out in the same year and in different countries. Uh, Guilty Gear 2 is also one of the really weird Japanese games that came out with the 360. Because uh, Japan does not like the 360 at all. Um... Like, Japan fucking hates the Xbox consoles. Professor, I want to be briefed on your findings as soon as you're on board. And I want to be found on your briefings as well. Now get on the space boat. Um, fuck those guys, I guess. They'll just die deaths on... Planet Fuck You. Alright. <laughs> I guess they're dead. Ten. Jesus Christ. Uh, oh, I got a silver medal. That's nice. Um, yeah, I might be able to play on uh, Heroic, but I kind of don't want to. Um, so let me just double check here. Oh, right. I'm recording that. Uh, I just want to check how long the recording is. Because this one's about seven minutes, this segment. And that one's 20. Okay, that's an episode. Um, because I don't want to, like, eat up a bunch of people's time. That, and I think that 30 minutes is a valid place for an episode. Um, this has been Halo Wars. It's honestly really interesting. It's really weird. Uh, I don't hate it, though. How many are there? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, fifteen. Okay, so we're about one fourth of the way through. Interesting. Theater, huh? Okay. Halo timeline. Whoa, <laughs> that's extreme. Okay, I'm eating up time. Uh, that's been Halo Wars. I have been Alfred. Thanks for coming on an adventure. I never played Halo Wars, and so seeing it for the first time, like, so many years away from anything relevant to Halo, uh, like, when the world is not being ruled by Halo, is honestly kind of surreal. Uh, I really dig it. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to. Like, later I might not, but... As of right now, I'm having fun. I am going to beat this game just because I'm going to beat every Halo game on camera. Uh, but that's been Halo Wars. Thanks for coming by. I've been Alfred. Stay curious about the future. Uh, remember to pet a cat if you see one. And don't step on any nails. <laughs>